Okay, Surfing Life, Surfing Life with Malcolm. Listen, uh, here we are in the next little instructional video. If you're out of sync anytime, look to the description below this video in YouTube and go to the correct step, right? For each one of these, I'm doing them in steps for you. I'm trying to keep them short. So this video is about sending Ethereum to your MetaMask wallet or your Trust Wallet if you're on the phone. You just follow along, right? And or you need to also send USDT, United States Dollar Tether. That's what this company, because we're a bank, right? You're your own bank, you're lending money. So you want to lend a stable, stable US dollar, right? So then the cryptocurrency, that's Tether, USDT. So we're going to do that. So you're going to need to open some different websites, right? So let's get to there and do that. You're going to need to have your GSN site and open it, right? So you're going to log into your GSN site and open it up. All right, so we're gonna log into your site. And you also want to have your MetaMask wallet open, right? So on your browser at top or over here, if you're you know, on a Mac or whatever, it'll show on this one, your Chrome extensions, right? And it'll show MetaMask. See, I have Tron Link and other wallets, right? It'll show, or it'll show the Fox, right? So whatever you're on, Chrome or Firefox, for your browser and you created, if you haven't done this, go and create your MetaMask wallets. In the, go to down below, watch the video on how to do that. So you're gonna open your MetaMask wallet and log in. I've already logged into mine, so it's ready to go. Now, yes, I have Ethereum in my wallet, and yes, I have USDT. So you need to create you're in your wallet, you've opened your MetaMask wallet, and I've showed you how to do that. And you need to, if you don't have anything in it, you just have zero and it shows zero Ethereum, right? So you would scroll down on your MetaMask wallet, right? See here, yours wouldn't have USDT, it would just show Ethereum and zero content. Don't panic, we're gonna get you some, right? So you're gonna scroll down where you see add token, right? So you go to add token, and you type in USDT and it will show right here Tether, right? Mine's like because I already have it, right? It will show Tether, Tether USDT. And you would click on it, yes, and go next and add it. Just follow the instructions and add it. And then you would end up with USDT. Now yours would show zero and your Ethereum will show zero. So you need to send some Ethereum to your wallet. That's the first thing you need to do. You need Ethereum in this MetaMask wallet because you need to do transactions and any transaction you do will need some gas, right? On the Ethereum blockchain, you gotta pay the miners. So the first thing you're gonna do is send some Ethereum. So we're gonna copy the address here, right? Then click on Ethereum and it will show you that you're gonna copy the one address fits for everything. So we're gonna copy the address, right? And you're going to go to your wallet, right? That you have, whatever you guys have, blockchain or, you know, I don't know, CoinJar, Coinbase, whatever wallet you got. So here, I'm going to be complicated for you. I'm on the exchange. You could be on the exchange. Why do I use my exchange wallet? Because that's the most complicated, right? So I'm going to make it the most difficult for everybody. So you're in your, you're in your wallet and you're gonna to go to whatever setting in your site for where you are, to what your wallet, and it's going to show what you have, right? So I've got 800 odd dollars in this wallet, okay? In the MetaMask wallet over here, there was more money. So now we're going, to, you want to look, most wallets have a swap, right? We look down here and we go to swap, and we're going to swap what we would like, right? So it's telling me I'm, uh, where am I? I don't want to do that, I want to go to here. Now on your wallet, it's going to tell you, you're going to go to swap. I already have it here. So I go to Ethereum and it shows I got $400 in Ethereum and I've got, four, wow, look at that, even Stevens, $400 in USDT. Check that out, right? That's just a coincidence. It happened like that today. I was selling a little Ethereum. I sold out of Ethereum went to USDT and I took half of it and sold back because it's been going up and down. I trade, right? So I need to send some Ethereum 
to my MetaMask wallet, right? I need to send a little. I, you know, I would be smart and say, look, I'm going to go through a couple dollars transaction, right? Ethereum is a bit expensive at the moment, but those transactions. So I'm on my Ethereum. So you're going to go to your wallet. You're going to withdraw. You're going to look and make sure you're choosing the right coin. So you're going to choose the right coin, whatever wallet you're in. It doesn't matter that mine's showing Binance. Your wallet, use your brains. Come on, you're smart with crypto. You're going to choose whatever amount. You're going to paste. See, when I click it, it already comes up because I've done it many times with this site. You're going to paste in the address. Now here, if you're new, you check that address. You go here and you go OXFF, OXFF. Yes, that's correct. 142A, 142A. Yes, I got the right wallet, right? And on your wallet, it's going to tell you, ask you if you have to, what network, ERC20 network, right? And I'm sending over some Ethereum, and I got 1.025, right? So if I send a, that, that's $400. So if I sent uh, 0 0.1 Ethereum, that would be $40, correct? That would be $40 getting sent to my account. That's a good amount. You know, you might want to send 50 or whatever it is. So you're going to click submit. You're going to put in whatever you have to do for your, you know, I'll show you with mine. I, I'm very secure. I have to put in an email verification. I have to put in a phone verification. And I have to put in an authy verification, right? So you're going to do that. You're going to send your Ethereum over, okay? I'm going to pause my video and while mine's gone. Okay, so we're back. So you've sent your Ethereum over. Mike, don't panic. It could take time. You check your wallet and you see, yes, I have my Ethereum, right? It's arrived in my wallet. You go, great. If you sent $25, it'll be $25 or $24.90, whatever, less the fee. If you sent $50, it'll be $50. If you send $100, it'll be $100. So you have Ethereum, right? Great. Now you also need to put USDT in this same wallet. We need the Ethereum for the gas fees. We need USDT for our loans and to pay our GST. Remember, if you have, if you already passed that part of putting money in your GST, I doubt it because you wouldn't. You would need to do this step first. Check in the description link below. In the bottom, you scroll down, look on the description. It's YouTube. I have all the links to each one of them. So now we need to send USDT to this account. Yeah, I know I've got it already there. But this is an instructional video for you. So it's the same address, right? So we go up here, count one. If you're not there, if something's wrong, click up here, go find it. It'll bring it up, right? And we copy, right? Copy. Anytime you get stuck, just pause this video. Just pause it. Okay, we copy it. We're going to go now to my wallet. And I'm going to choose in my wallet, whatever you're in, Coinbase, CoinJar, whatever it is, blockchain wallet, Ethereum wallet, Trust wallet, whatever it is, and you're going to be doing Tether, right? So you need to go to your swap and swap whatever you got to Tether. You need to get some Tether. If you're on the exchange, right, you're going to go to your trading in your exchange, right? Let's have a little look quick if you're on an exchange. Here am I on my exchange, right? Ah, oh, look at that, it's nighttime. How do I change this to... That's okay, we'll leave it at nighttime. Let's see. How many people like us? Uh, let's go to daytime here, right? Make it nice and white for the YouTube clip. Okay, so we're on the exchange, and uh, I'm gonna go to, 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 Fiat, USDT, if you're on the exchange. If you're not using exchange, just bear with me for one sec, and, uh, we're going, you know, we're going to buy some USDT. So here I have $400 worth of Ethereum, and I want to buy USDT. So I'm looking, I'm, I'm on this one here, right? right? What am I on? Ethereum USDT, yes. So, you know, it would be buy, I'm showing buy Ethereum because I already have USDT. Okay, let's go to the... Uh, Let's go to, that's okay. It would be sell, whichever one you're gonna do and you're gonna buy or sell, right? To make that happen, got it? If you're on an exchange, you should know that, how to use an exchange if you're doing it. So you're just in your wallet. For you people who got regular wallets, <coughs> pardon me, 
and we're going to swap. We go to swap, and we're swapping some Ethereum, or we're going to swap Bitcoin, or whatever it is. We're going to change it, and if it's drawn, or whatever you got, you want to get US Tether, right? USDT. So we get our USDT. Now we're going to send it to our MetaMask wallet, remember? So we've copied that account, we copied the address. So we go withdraw, and we look and we go, uh -huh, I don't want Bitcoin. No, 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 no. I am sending Tether. So you go to your Tether, you look, yes, I have balance, I did that, you know. And I put my address in. Now look, see, mine is already done, MetaMask, right? I created an address for this one. And you put in what it's going to be, right? ERC20. That's what you got. It's got to be ERC20. You go to this one, it'll go, no, it doesn't address. See, it does not match. If that changes, you got to change your network. ERC20. And you got to put in the amount. Remember, I said you need $200 worth of GST. Remember I said that? You could do 20, but you'll use it up on your very first transaction. You could do 100, you get five contracts out of that. 200 you G in GST with the company will get you 20 loans, right? So uh, get you 10 loans. So you're gonna send your money. So you put in how much you would like to send, right? In, in, uh, in, in here, right? So you're gonna send it, you say whatever you want, and you're gonna do submit. Right? And you're going to send it off. And you do, you know, if I do mine, like you said before, I go do all my verifications. Okay? I'm going to pause this video and let you go ahead and do that as well. So we're back. Great. Fantastic. So we look and we're on our site. We've logged into our GSN site, right? So we go to our MetaMask wallet and we have a look and our balance of whatever we sent in USDT is there. Fantastic. Great. I've got USDT, right? So now I can move forward. I can go and provide a loan, right? Remember the next step is gonna be, now that you've done that, you need to get GST, right? You need to get GST. So go look below in the description and look for the one, the step, I believe it's step three, get or step two, right? Get GST for your account. I've got 280 in GST here. You need 100. Right? You want to get a hundred. You're in business. You're a bank. I put 200 to start. I didn't want to have to keep doing this. I just added 80 doing another clip earlier today. So you're going to go get GST. First, you're going to have to supply your wallet. You go, what are you talking about? Well, I'll tell you what. Just go down below. Just go down below. This one's over. I'm going to stop this one. Have a look and open the next video and see the next step to do that. So we've sent money to our wallet. We've got money in our trust wallet, in our MetaMask wallet. We got USDT and we got Ethereum, right? There's my Ethereum, there's my USDT. So every time I'm doing something, if I'm gonna buy GST, which is gonna come out of my USDT, I need to send it to an address, right? It's telling me, and I will do it. It'll cost a dollar or two dollars in Ethereum gas. That's why you got Ethereum. So I'm so glad you're on board. I'm so glad you've decided to be a bank. I'm so glad you've decided to go out there and create loans. You see, now I'm just brand new in this, but I've been earning. I've earned on this one, this contract here, Surfing Life One, I've earned $20. I've only just started in this. And there, I've got another contract. I've earned $20 on that one too. It's only two days going into my fourth day. I go to another one, if you look, remember, I have another contract. I've earned $10 on that one already in the first day. I go to the next one on number four. I have a look. I've earned $10. Look, $1,010. I've earned $10 on that contract as well. So what have I earned? I've earned 20 and 20 and 10 and 10. And I go to the next one and I've earned $5 on that contract. See, $1,005. I've earned five on that one. And I go to the last one, which I just did today doing a clip. So I haven't earned anything. It hasn't gone. So you understand? I've got multiple loans out. I'm a few days into this and I have six loans already. So you can, I want you to do that. So look in the links below. Great to have you on board. Great to have your own bank. Looking forward to surfing life together. Thanks a lot. This is Mal. And check the next step. Go to the next step. Buy GST, right? That's your next step. Buy GST. Thanks a lot.